If you have twins, this might look familiar. Twin mama hack number one. When you go to public restrooms with twin toddlers, it could be challenging if you are trying to help one, the other one is just touching everything, getting into everything, getting the toilet paper. It is just very challenging. When I go to public restrooms with the twins, I keep them contained in the double stroller. They're strapped in, so nowhere else to go. I help one and the other one has to stay in the stroller. And then when I'm done with the first one, I go on the second one and no mess, not touching everything. And everybody's happy. Twin mom hack number two. You know how it's going to public places by yourself with the twins. It could be challenging to get them out of places because they want to keep exploring. As a twin mama, my double stroller is way more than a way of transportation. It is my ultimate tool to get my twins out of public places easy. Twin mom hack number three. You know as a twin mom that one of our twins always has to wait in the heat while the other one is getting situated in the car seat and I just feel so bad for my waiting twin especially here it gets so hot that's why on those hot days I make sure I park east because I open the trunk of my car and then there is always shade that one of my twins can be more comfortable waiting while I help the other one get in the car seat. Twin mom hack number four. I always dreaded going to the store. I thought it was just too much of a hassle getting the twins in the car, getting men out of the car, getting them to behave in the store. Grocery store pickup is just a gift sent from heaven to all of us twin mamas. We don't have to get the twins out of the car seat and it could be at our own convenient hours. Twin mom hack number five. I call to check on my mom and my mother-in-law often, but I just find it so difficult to be able to talk to them on the phone while um, taking care of the twins because there is always something going on I'm multitasking and I just feel I cannot pay attention to whatever they saying or whatever I'm doing my time in the car it's golden to do all the phone calls that I need to do especially if the twins are calm or they're taking a nap that's my time to call my mother-in-law and my mom <laughs> twin mom hack number six when it comes to listening to podcasts or listening to audiobooks, even if I try to wear earphones, my twins try to pull them, and if I'm not wearing them, it's just hard to hear with all the noise. Again, my car is just the best place I've found so far to listen to my favorite shows and to listen to my audiobooks. Twin mom hack number seven. We as twin moms, we're usually with our hands full. <laughs> Not just full of babies, but full of things. <laughs> On those days that I don't have anybody to help me carry things, my stroller is my best helper to carry everything for me. Twin mom hack number eight. The number of diapers and wet wipes that twins go through is insane. I make my own baby wipes, that's my twin mama money saving hack. I mix two cups of water, one tablespoon of organic baby soap and two tablespoons of organic coconut oil. I mix it, I pour half of that on paper towel. Then I turn the paper towel and I pour the other half. I close the container, I let it rest for two minutes upside down. After two minutes, I open the container, I take the middle cardboard out, and then voila, my baby wipes are done. Twin mom hack number nine. 
If you have twins, the most possible thing is that you're always rushing and on the times that you are rushing the most is when you cannot find your twin socks, your twin shoes. I always keep a pair of shoes, a pair of socks for each one of them in the car and that's just something less that I have to think about when I'm leaving the house. Twin mom hack number 10, when my twins were babies and people helped me feed them, it got confusing. We ended up not knowing who drank what because the bottles looked the same. We solved the problem with stickers. We placed the sticker in one of the bottles, we assigned it to one of the twins and we let everybody know and that's how we got rid of the confusion. Twin mom hack number 11. If one of my twins doesn't take a nap and the other one does, I might end up with twins with different bedtimes. To prevent that twin bedtime disaster, I make sure that my napper takes a short nap that day so he is sleepy at the same time as his brother for bedtime. I actually have a full video about bedtime hacks for twins. I'm going to leave a card here on top or I'm going to leave a link in the description so you can go and watch it. Twin mom hack number 12. I wanted to build a book of memories for my twins. It is a hassle when you have to take care of twins and you are left with a mess to clean up. I still record awesome memories with no mess at my fingertips using Simple Prints. Simple Prints is an app where I can build any photo book, very affordable, and it doesn't take me time. I can put the pictures that are already in my camera roll and they deliver the books right to my door. By the way, this video is not sponsored, but I wanted to mention it because I love this app. Twin mom hack number 13. Do you find it difficult to get ready in the morning? Let me know in the comments. Silence is suspicious when you have toddlers and even more suspicious when you have twin toddlers. I placed a baby monitor in the living room. When I get ready, I take the monitor and I can check what they're doing without disrupting my activity. Twin mom hack number 14. Those crayons on the wall, sometimes twins team up for the mischief. And many times we twin moms end up with art wall that it's definitely hard to clean up. Using Mr. Clean Magic Eraser and Windex together, it is a powerhouse when it comes to melting crayon and markers on the wall. Twin mom hack number 15. The mornings could be crazy with twins. To avoid rushing, packing their things, trying to leave the house, I actually pack the diaper bag the night before and I put it in the car so the next day that's one thing that I don't have to think about is just grab the twins and go. Twin mom hack number 16. Cooking while the twins are awake, it is way more difficult. You have to attend to the food and you have to attend to them at the same time. It is better to meal prep and cook once they go for bedtime. Twin mom hack number 17. If one of my twins says he wants to go potty, I immediately offer the other one and I get two kids on one trip. If this kind of content is of value to you, I encourage you to subscribe and to hit the notification bell. Every week I'm here giving you very practical mom hacks, parenting tips. Those were my twin mom hacks that saved me time, money, headaches, and if you have one that I didn't mention and is a must do for you, please let me know in the comments all the products that I recommend and mentioned. They're going to be in the description down below. We got these moms.